What's up, y'all? I'm trying to do the Chick-fil-A versus Popeyes. And it is so crazy, y'all. It is like literally a line to get in to Popeyes. I'm going to show you this line. I can't even get over there. This is the line to get into Popeyes. All these, it's been like this all day, like every day, literally. Everybody's trying to get in here. Y'all, I'm gonna be like so mad if I get up here and they're like, they say, we out of chicken sandwiches, so sorry for you. But this line has literally been hanging out of the parking lot onto the street for the past couple of days. Like everybody's trying to get in here to see how this chicken sandwich tastes. If it really matches Chick-fil-A or goes above and beyond or it's just a flop. But yeah, I'm trying to see too. So hopefully it's what it's all cracked up to be. And yeah. So yeah, I just wanted to get that video for you guys so we can see what it is. And I feel so bad for these people who have like parked in the parking lot. They got a parking space and they parked. I was like, what sense does that make? Why would you do that? Because you're going to get stuck. Like, you literally going to get stuck in here. You can't get out. Or it's going to be some work to get out of your parking space. But this little truck up here, this Ford, like, it's a double cab. He worked it. Go ahead. I would have scraped somebody's car the heck up. I would have literally scraped somebody's car. So, yeah. But I hope you guys are having a great day. My day is going good. The line is moving, y'all. The line is moving. I don't think I'm going to park. I'm not going to park on the side. Although I think it would be faster if I like parked and went in and got my chicken sandwich. It would be quicker. But for the fact that I don't want to get stuck, I am going to wait. I'm going to wait. I'm going to wait in this long line wrapped around the building. I'm going to wait. see how I get out of here and Chick-fil-A is like right next door how ironic is that Chick-fil-A and Popeyes is like right next door to each other so let's see <laughs> I'll be right back once I get to the window all right bye thanks for the Popeyes how may I help you um can I order the new chicken sandwich please how many just one I'm sorry one you want spicy or the classic um, give me spicy, please. Spicy? Yes. Eight bigger for you? Um, that'll be it. You want to check seven by itself? Yes, ma'am. Got my chicken sandwich right here. Let's see how it goes. So I leaving Chick fil A. I just got my sandwich and I got the spicy chicken sandwich combo sorry I was shy to record in front of everyone so didn't do it but yeah I got it now it's time to head home 
y'all first of all while i take this out i set in popeye's line forever in a day just to get this sandwich it felt like i sat in that line for probably about 30 minutes trying to get this sandwich right here because the line was like legit curving out onto the road and everybody knew mom was trying to get it and yeah this is the chick-fil-a sandwich and this is the Popeyes sandwich. It comes wrapped like this. We don't need that. It's like that. Okay, comparison. As you can see, one sandwich is bigger than the other. Popeyes is bigger than um, Chick fil A. This is Chick fil A. Um, the Chick this is the Chick fil A sandwich. And this is the Popeye sandwich. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so far, everybody has been saying that they like the Popeye's chicken sandwich. Only one person today said they didn't like it because they said the buns were sweet. And they didn't like that. But I'm going to try it anyway. You know, I have to try it. Um, the Popeye's chicken sandwich, it has pickles and some sauce. It's like a crispy patty. And on the Chick-fil-A, I got pepper jack cheese and extra pickles on it. No need to show you that because everybody knows what that is. Let me give you a close-up. See, the chicken is kind of crispy looking. Looks good. But yeah, I got that. And I got a lemonade with Splenda. Like, that makes it any better. But, yeah, I got that. And I forgot. And I had went to McDonald's and I got a um, caramel frap. I've been on coffee trip for about maybe a week now. And, yeah, I, I like my iced coffee now. So good. McDonald's. So good. But... You know, I couldn't just get that. I had to get me some fries from Chick-fil-A. Because, you know, Chick-fil-A's waffle fries are the bomb. Good little nap napkins. And I got some sauce. I got Chick-fil-A sauce, some ranch and hot sauce. Um, dang. Uh, for the... Popeye's sandwich, I think it was $4 and something. That's what it came out to. And at Chick-fil-A, for the meal, it came out to $8.43. So yeah, let's get into this and see who's king. Who's king of the chicken sandwiches? And... Is it just, mm, I'm sorry. Is it just black people who love the heck out of some ranch with their food? You know they associate that with every time we go somewhere. If there's some ranch on the table, you better get it for them black folks too. They gonna eat all that ranch. I was looking at my dog, Mr. Gizmo. And I have some hot sauce in case I want to make it extra spicy, you know. And some places be playing with my emotions when they say stuff is spicy and it's not. And I be looking like, where's the kick? Where's the spice? Um. Anyways, which one should we try first? We know how this, know how um, Chick Fil A's taste, so let's get a bite. Mmm. Good as usual. Very good. So what have y'all been up to today? Today I had to work. My first job, I worked two jobs. I only had to work one today. 
let's talk about how a sandwich is. Um, it's a good thickness. The meat is a good thickness. Got the right spice to it. Of course, I put pepper jack cheese on it and it's already spicy too. And I've added extra pickles to it. So, it's always good. Mm, clear my mouth. Little rinsing it. Maybe I should put it on this side. I'll just put it right there. Now, that's how thick their chicken sandwich is. Let's get a bite. In a good place. Mmm. Mmm. <laughs> it's good. It's really good. Chick fil A. Chick fil A. <laughs> Popeye's trying to mess with y'all. I don't eat chicken sandwiches from nowhere but Chick fil A. Now I have another place Popeye's. Pop eyes. Mm hmm. Pop eyes. It's good. I really liked it. It's juicy. The crisp. It's kind of it's crispy. I should have asked for extra pickles on here too, but I forgot. Um, I don't taste the sweetness in the bun. The, for y'all who've tried it, um, is the bun sweet to you? It's not sweet to me. Um, yeah, I really like it. Let's do some fries Chick-fil-a sauce it's always so good who when you eat your chicken sandwich take the chick-fil-a sauce and put it on your sandwich that's the bomb that tastes so good too I might try it on the Popeyes bring them both together and see how it goes Y'all see my dog over here trying to beg? It's for me. Not for you. Y'all, my dog is allergic to ranch. I have a chihuahua. And he is allergic to ranch. You weird. Just weird, bro. <laughs> he hung his head down like, why well, I gotta be weird? You weird, who's allergic to ranch? Yeah, I was eating a salad one day and um, he was begging for it and I gave him some of my salad and it had ranch on it. And about 30 minutes later, he was like struggling to breathe a little bit. He had labored breathing and his face swole up a little bit. And I called the vet and I told her how, what he was doing, what was going on, what happened. And yeah, I did it. And I told her what happened. She was like, from what you're telling me, he sounds like he's allergic to ranch. She was like, I've never heard of that, but he sounds like he's allergic to ranch. And she told me to give him um, some children's Benadryl. Oh. I um I went to uh, Walgreens and I got him some children's Benadryl and the lady that was working there she said her dog is also allergic to ranch and she has a chihuahua too so is it a chihuahua thing or other dogs 
I don't know. But. Mm, I'm so glad to be at home. I'm so tired. And it looks like it's going to rain. Which I hope it does. Like just rain hard. Just come down. It's late in the day. It's like. Probably. Let me see. It's almost 630. That's why I have the light on in the back. I didn't make it home in time to catch the light. Real good. So I can record. So I apologize for the lighting. Um, yeah. Oh. While we doing this. Please comment, rate, and subscribe to my channel.